In this video, you're going to learn how to use an open pan balance. Open pan balances like this one are very simple to use. They have digital displays and are typically used when more precise balances are not necessary or when the sample is too heavy for them. It's common practice to first weigh your sample on the open pan balance and then do it on a more precise balance because this balance is less vulnerable to chemical spills. The first thing to do before starting is to make sure that it's level. To do this, check the window behind the pan here. If the bubble is located within the black circle, then the balance is level. If it's not level, do not attempt to adjust it yourself. Just tell your TA and use a different balance. The balance should be turned on before you start. You'll know that it's on because numbers will be displayed on the front screen. If your scale is off, check with your TA because it might be off for a reason. So just use a different balance. The last thing to do before you begin is to make sure that your balance is teared. This means the display on the screen is zero. If the displayed weight is above or below zero, just push the tear button. This will re-zero the balance and make it ready for use. Make sure that both the balance and your weighing vessel are free of chemical contamination and moisture. Then place your vessel on the round metal pan. Wait for the reading to stabilize and then record it. You can now remove your vessel, making sure that you've left no debris behind. If some solid has spilled on the pan, remove it with a brush and dispose of it properly in your waste beaker. If liquid has spilled on the pan, clean it appropriately using a sponge or paper towel. Do not allow spilled chemicals to remain on the pan as this will damage the balance. You've now successfully weighed your sample. Sometimes you may wish to weigh your sample without including the weight of the vessel that it's in. To do this, make sure that your balance is level and zeroed, then place your empty vessel onto the balance. Wait for it to stabilize, then push the tear button. You'll notice that the mass changes to zero. You can now add your sample to the vessel. The weight on the display will be only that of the sample you've added. You can continue to add more sample to your vessel until you reach the desired mass. If you happen to overshoot your target weight, don't remove the sample back into the original container. Instead, transfer some into the waste vessel. Using an open pan balance is a very common and simple part of working in a chemistry lab. But if done improperly, you can damage the balance or ruin your experiment. So if you follow the instructions I've told you, you can always trust your results.